Yeah, and we're here today just to talk about some of the new things. Starts the day off with a bang. Are the performers with Goose as well have branched off into a new area. Usually I wash it out. Hi, welcome to Backstage Pass. My name is Kim Betcher, and with me again is Rachel Hofstrand. We are the marketing co uh, workers here um, at the Historic Homes Theater and at the center. So, we are busy um, right now doing a lot of spring and summer um, activities going on. And if you have not received yet your spring or summer program guide, it was out in the newspaper um, a couple weeks ago. Um, it's also available at the front desk, but in it is packed full of things, which we'll get to on the fitness side, but there's also some really great spring and summer shows coming up. So Yes, we have a busy April. Uh, well, we're busy all. Yeah. We're always busy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but uh, we did a really good job of getting some more shows booked for us, so mm -hmm. there's a lot more shows now that, you know, everyone gets our great season brochure but a lot has been added even though our season is not quite over so yeah so so check that out and so check out the information so. all our new stuff is online we have these great little handouts um all our new shows are in here too so uh the next thing we have coming up this saturday is uh the heart of lakes harmony they are a men's acapella group they're kind of they're local yeah um they are doing a tribute to dick clark and the american oh, bandstand cool. So, cool. yep, that is this Saturday at 7.30 here in the theater. And then the next day, the Lakes Area Community Concert Band is doing their spring concert at 4 o'clock. Okay, that's great. It's just two great shows if you're looking for um, some fun, some listening to some really great music by some local artists. Mm -hmm. It's really, really great. And so. it's free admission, but we ask for a free will donation for the Lakes Area Community Concert Band one. So, yeah. But it, they're, they're so much fun. They are great. Yeah, so cool. Mm -hmm. So, And then we also have something coming up that's, so, that's also very fun in April that we look forward to every year because it's a big party celebrating arts. Mm -hmm. And it this year it's Motion is celebrating Chicago. Yeah. Um, April 23rd is our motion fundraiser. Uh, we have a great group coming called Transit Authority. They are the premier Chicago tribute band. So we are celebrating all things Chicago, the music, the city, the uh, food. The food. <laughs> yes. We can't have a party without some really good food. So. Yes, there is food. So uh, you can come dressed in your favorite Chicago themed, uh, can be an era from the 20s or Blues man, diva, sports, or you can come dressed however you like. Yeah, yeah. So it's that's, a really great night. Yeah. So if you have not been to Motion, um, come check them out. Um, tickets are available online um, or, or here at the, or box, here office, at the box office or with or Judy. So come on in and um, get those taken care of. So it's a lot of fun. So look for more information um, on that. That would be great. Um, if you're interested and then we like we said we have lots of things happening with the spring and summer um, programs and activities our um, fitness our new fitness classes um, kicked off this last week and so we have all kinds of land and water classes going on as far as um, we have our tai chi cha is extended our yoga thea is extended we have our um, we have our, uh, some water classes happening. Um, we have a hydro fit class happening for teens um, in the afternoon. In addition, we have our um, Sun for Swim program getting going. Dave has indoor baseball happening right now. So, and with it all, I know we, I was on with Dave a few weeks ago, but with it all, we have, um, just remember the weather hasn't quite taken us over that peak of really warm and really nice right now. Um, but we do have the opportunity um, indoors to do some golfing and some hitting with our batting cage and our golf nets that are up. So if you're interested at all in that, um, we have that as well. So um, also, uh, if you're looking for things to do this summer um, and doing some pre-planning, I know I pulled my schedule out this last weekend um, to start to plot the camps and things like that that the kids are yeah. going to and, the, and some of those things. Um, we do have a couple theater camps that are happening. Um, that if you want to find more information, you can check that out online or in the, in the program guide. Um, but we are, in addition to Missoula Children's Theater, we're also helping um, the um, community, community ed um, yep. host the Prairie Fire. Yep. So we'll have two weeks of <coughs> Children's Theater instead of just one this year. So Yeah, so if you're looking for that, that mm -hmm. would um, be really great. So for you, if you have kids or grandkids that are coming, um, great, maybe visitors, nieces, nephews that are coming um, to the area for the summer, um, check out those dates because we do, it's not just for kids in Detroit Lakes or around the region, mm -hmm. it's kind of for visitors who like to do that. The next thing that we have um, is if you're also interested at all is our summer day camp. Um, Dave is taking registrations for that. Um, he's got another open house coming up this Saturday, um, April 16th. And so, um, so if you want to know a little bit more about what the summer day camp does, um, you can certainly look at that. But one of the cool things is, is that if you're in the summer day camp and you attend the um, Missoula, it's actually free. So, yeah. or one of the theater camps. Yeah. And so, um, so there's lots of ways that we 
can get kids involved, but they're looking at field trips again um, all, over the, all over the area. So um, if you're interested at all, again, if kids and grandkids, um, another great thing to do. And from a plotting standpoint, uh, make your summer plans now. So awesome. So thanks again for joining us for Backstage Pass. My name is Kim, and this is Rachel, and we'll see you again next week.